Hello everyone, welcome back to the Gate Engineering Online Learning Classes. In this video of Digital Electronics, today we are going to discuss about arithmetic operation of signed binary number using two's complement form. In the last video, we have seen the similar problems by using one's complement form. And so, first of all, uh, we should know how to represent a positive number in two's complement form as well as how to represent a negative number in two's complement form. Then you already know we have already discussed in the previous video like how to do the arithmetic operation using one's complement form and two's complement form for unsigned binary number. But here we have a signed binary number like positive number as well as negative number. So first we see how to write the signed binary number using two's complement form. Let me take one example of plus 3. In 4 bit, I will write the magnitude of 3 is 0011. Okay, and plus is indicated by the 0 in the lamp post bit. So this is the sine bit and this is the magnitude. So this is called sine magnitude representation of plus 3. And whose complement representation is also similar. We don't take the complement of sine by any number if number is positive 0, 0, 0, 1, 1. Now if we talk about minus 3, minus 3 will be represented by 1, 0, 0, 1, 1 in the sine magnitude. This one is indicating to the negative number and double 0, double 1 is the 3. So this is the negative number indicated by 1, double 0, double 1 in sine magnitude. Now how to write this number in 2's complement form? Just take the 2's complement of its magnitude that is two's complement of double zero double one. So what is the, what will be the two's complement of double zero double one? Double one zero one. And most significant bit will be the same because it is indicating to the only sign bit. So our number is triple one zero one, which is indicating to minus three in two's complement form. So let me solve a few examples based on uh, arithmetic operations of signed by any number using two's complement form. We take with the example plus 12, addition of plus 12 with plus 3, we know our result should be satisfied to plus 15. So how to write plus 12 in the 2's complement form? And you know the 2's complement representation of positive number is same as the signed magnitude representation of positive number. So it is nothing but it is similar to 0 double 1 double 0. Double 1 double 0 is the magnitude of 12 and 0 is indicating to the positive number. Similarly, Plus 3 will be 0, 0, 0, 1, 1. If we add this result, our result will be 1, 1, 1, 1, 0. Therefore, you can see there is no carry here, there is no sign weight is high. This sign weight is low, which is positive number. If sign weight is 0, we will find out the result as it is, it is 15, so plus 15. There is no carry, there is no sign weight is high, sign weight is low here, so it is plus 15, which is perfectly correct indicated by 0 double 1 double 1 in this form. Coming to the next example which is plus 12 with minus 13. So plus 12 and minus 3 our result are expecting as plus 9. So plus 12 will be written as 0 double 1 double 0 as we have already seen in the previous example. Now we will see how to write minus 3 into complement form. Minus 1 will, minus will be represented by 1 and 3 will be 0 0 1 1 in the magnitude and its 2's complement will be 1 1 1 0 1. So we need to add 0 double 1 double 0 with triple 1 0 1. If we add this 1 0 plus 0 is 0, 1 plus 1 is 0, sum is 0, carry is 1. 1 plus 1 plus 1 is sum is 1, carry is also 1 because 1 plus 1 plus 1 is 11. 1 plus 1 is sum is 0, carry is 1, that will come here. So now what we can observe? The numbers are in the 5 bit only, but our result is in the 6 bit here. So these two are in the 5 bits and here we have in the 6 bit. So this is our result with sign bit and this is the carry. If carry is high in the 2's complement form, we need to discard the carry. This carry, we need to discard the carry. But in the 1's complement form, we add this carry with the sum. Here we need to discard the carry without adding with the result. Now what we have? We have result 0, 1, double, 0, 1 after discarding the carry. And the sign width is positive, therefore our result is this is correct, which is plus 9. We don't do any complement, we don't take any complement if sign width is 0 or sign width is low. If sign width will be high, we will take the complement as we have seen in the previous examples or previous video. 
using one's complement form. Let me take another example where result is minus 12 and plus 3. What do we expect in this result? Minus 9. How to write minus 12 in the 2's complement form? 0. Uh, it will be uh, like uh, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0. This is the sign magnitude representation of minus 12. It's minus 12. Now, 2's complement of minus 12 is 1, 0, 1, 0, 0. This is the 2's complement representation of minus 12. Okay. So, we'll write 2's complement representation of minus 12, which is 1, 0, 1, double 0. And plus 3 will be written as 0, 0, 0, 1, 1. If we add these two numbers, our result is 1, 1, 1, 0, 1. So what do we have? There is no carry, okay? But sine width is high. This sine width is high. It means result is negative. Sine width, result is negative. So we'll take the one's complement. Sorry, two's complement of the result because we are subtracting or we are adding the numbers using two's complement form. So we'll take the two's complement of the result if sine width is high or if sine width is one. So 2's complement of this result will be 1, 0, 0, 1 and sine width is 1. So, this is our answer of this, this problem. So, if we verify it by converting in the decimal, sine a decimal number, 1, double, 0, 1 is 9 and this width is 1. So, it is minus 9 which is perfectly satisfying to the our result. Coming to the next problem with both the numbers are negative, minus 12 and minus 13, minus 12 and minus 3. We need to add these two numbers and we know our result will be minus 15. Let me solve this problem with the help of 2's complement form. 2's complement representation of minus 12 will be like uh, uh, we'll write first uh, 12 as 1, 1, 1, 0, 0. This is the minus 12 in sign magnitude. 2's complement will be 1, 0, 1, 0, 0. Minus 12 2's complement is 1, 0, 1, 0, 0. Now minus 3, 2's complement representation will be this is for 12, minus 12, now minus 3, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1. 2's complement will become 1, 1, 1, 0, 1. So we need to add with 1, 1, 1, 0. If we add this number, 1, 1 plus 1 is 0, 1 plus uh, 1 is 0, and 1 plus 1 plus 1 is 1, 1. So this is the result. What we can observe, we have carry as well as high side width. So this is the carry discard the carry here we need to discard the carry after discarding our we have result is one triple zero one but sine width is also high here this is the sine width which is high indicating to the negative number we need to take the two's complement of our sum so what will be the two's complement of this it will be one 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 and sine width will be as it is so if we read this number in sine binary it is 15 and this one is minus, so we have minus 15. I hope you like this video uh, on binary subtractions using two's complement form on signed binary number. Uh, if you like this video, please subscribe the channel to get more update about such videos that will be helpful for your university exam as well as your competitive such uh, competitive exam like uh, GATE and IPSOP. Thank you so much for your. Thank for watching this video.